2 2 from Capuano and the changeup struck him note. They say that Nickius did not catch it out of the air and the home plate umpire Doug Edding says not strike three. Let's see. He tipped it. Ooh, he oh he caught ball. it. He caught it. That clearly should have been strike three and Terry Collins comes out to argue. Now that's a play where the home plate umpire could ask for help yes. from the base umpire because there's no way the home plate umpire can see if that ball hits the ground. He's asking home plate umpire Doug Eddings to ask for help. And Doug is not going to looks like he's not going to ask for it. You got the crew chief Dana DeMuth down at first base. It would be his call if he asks for help. And Terry keeps gesturing down to first base to plead with him to ask for DeMuth's opinion. And Eddings clearly is saying to him that he saw it. And Terry is saying, There's no way you could see it. You're screened. You got the catcher in the way. There's no way that you can see if that ball hit the ground or not. Terry is yet to be ejected from a game. He gets closer and closer. Doug is in the short sleeves out there. He seems very calm. I think he wants it. Yep, he wanted to get run. So Terry Collins ejected from a game for his first time as a Mets manager, and now he's going to get his money's worth. So much frustration built up over these first three weeks of the season for a team that has the worst record in Major League Baseball, and that clearly was a call that should have gone the Mets' way. Oh, it's getting the fans are riled up. Doug Eddings very calm. I'm surprised that Dana DeMuth, the whole, the uh, first base umpire and crew chief, has not come over to break up this conversation. Let's look one more time at the foul tip. That's clearly a catch. As long as the ball does not hit the ground or any other part of the catcher's equipment other than the glove, it's a third strike. And it does not appear to hit the ground. Caught it. Clearly. Not even a question.